All right then my friends, so when we create a new view project, if you look inside the package.json file over here, we can see we have this dependency down here, the CLI service. Now this thing installs a binary called the view CLI service inside our project. And then we can use that to do various things like spin up a local development server, build our app for production, or inspect the webpack config file, etc. And also other third party plugins like ESLint can inject additional commands to the CLI service like lint. And we're gonna see that in a second. So if we scroll up here, we can see this in action. We say view CLI service, then the command name. So this is using this right here, okay? Now, if we wanna serve up this application in a local development server, we would say view CLI service serve. Now, we don't have to write that out. All we need to do is say npm run and then serve because we have this script stored in our package.json file. The same for building, the same for linting, okay? So this one right here, this is something that that lint plugin has added on to this view CLI service. So first of all, let's try this out. Let's serve this up in a local development server just so we can preview the application. So the way we do that is by saying npm run serve, press enter, and this will spin up a local development server so we can then preview the application on it. Okay, so now we can control click on this link and it's gonna open up. It's opened up on a different screen, so I'm just gonna scoot that over. And now we can see this application right here. So the same rules apply. If we were to make a change in our application code, it's gonna auto reload and we're gonna see that change right here in this browser, okay? So that's how we serve up the application in a local development server so we can preview the application as we're creating it. Uh, the next one right here, build. I'm not gonna do that just now because I'm gonna show you how we can build the application later on, but I wanna show you this one, lint. So I'm gonna control C to cancel out of this process. Then I'm gonna say npm run and lint. And what this will do is check for any errors, any linting errors in our code. Now, currently there shouldn't be any because we've not made any changes, but later on, if we were to make changes, we can check if there are any linting errors right here and it will log them down here in the console for us, which is pretty cool. So that's pretty simple, right? So this is the CLI service in a nutshell. We just use it to do these different things like serve up our application, build it, lint it, and other things as you progress with your application as well.